Lucia. Do you know why you're here? Bad luck, I guess. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and Christmas came early this year as Rockstar dropped the trailer for their long-awaited next mainline Grand Theft Auto game. For this list, we'll be looking at things we noticed in the trailer, as well as theorizing about mechanics and story elements from the next upcoming Rockstar epic. Number 10. Flashback? Do you know why you're here? Bad luck, I guess. When we're first introduced to Lucia at the start of the trailer, she seems to be speaking to her probation officer, or maybe even lawyer, negotiating her release. With concept art of the game highlighting Lucia's ankle monitor, there's a strong possibility the entire game could be told via flashback with Lucia or Jason recounting the events that led to their incarceration. The trailer's focus on the pair's ride-or-die mentality could also come into play with the possibility of Lucia playing both sides in exchange for her release, or eventual betrayal at the end of the game where the player needs to decide the outcome, similar to GTA V's conclusion. Trust. Trust. Number 9. Small Scale With GTA V, the heists the players could take part in grew in scale as the game went on, even involving helicopters and planned escape routes. While we're sure that our duo's escapades will grow in complexity as the game continues, what was teased in the trailer seems to show the pair starting out a bit smaller time, knocking over convenience stores and diners in the beginning. This mechanic is also seemingly lifted from Red Dead Redemption 2, as players could throw on a mask and rob any convenience store they walked into. With reports also indicating GTA 6 will have more buildings for players to enter than ever before, the limit to how much you could rob might only be capped by your wanted level. Number 8. GTA Radio One of the longest running and most beloved aspects of the GTA series is undoubtedly its radio selections. Featuring original songs and radio shows, as well as some licensed tracks, players have long found their own personal favorites dating all the way back to GTA 3 on the PS2. With the more contemporary setting, as well as the focus on social media, players could end up listening to podcasts instead of traditional radio shows that could also evolve alongside the game's story, with commenters speculating on the player's antics in the world. Given the ever-evolving underground music scene, we also wouldn't be surprised to find numerous NPCs pushing players to download their newest tracks in the game's versions of SoundCloud. The way she it should be. Number 7. Social Media Stars The focus on social media and its impact on society is one of the primary highlights of the reveal trailer, with many NPCs living it up via social media posts which ironically were recreated by Rockstar from real life posts. This newfound focus on social media could also translate over to gameplay, with our protagonists escalating antics, turning them into folklore heroes of the digital age, much like the real Bonnie and Clyde were back during the height of their crime sprees. Players could also pick new missions or track down hidden quests via social media posts, further ingraining this aspect into the game's overall narrative. Well, look who's back! Number 6. Select a Character While the GTA series has always primarily been a one-protagonist experience, GTA V shook up the formula by offering players three characters to take control of whenever they wanted in between missions. GTA 6 seems to be scaling things back a bit with what seems to be our only two main characters, Lucia and her boyfriend Jason. Although the trailer focuses primarily on Lucia, we expect Jason to play an equal role in the narrative while also giving players the opportunity to switch back and forth outside of missions. Don't let good tech go to waste, right Rockstar? Also, according to recent leaks, players will be able to switch perspective mid-mission while also being able to issue commands to the other character. Number 5. Living World as the series and developer has evolved, so too has its NPCs, but none have been more realistically represented than in Red Dead Redemption 2. Not only did NPCs react realistically to any given situation, but they also had their own daily routines they would follow that players could easily keep track of. Likewise, Rockstar put a lot of effort into its wildlife as well, with the creatures of the Wild West living their best digital lives throughout the game. Rockstar is clearly putting all that tech to good use, as not only is the world of Vice City bustling with countless NPCs, but there is also a significant focus on the game's wildlife as well, something sorely missing from past GTA games. Number 4. Factions There has never been a shortage of rival gangs for the player to contend with throughout the GTA series, but GTA 6 might be the first game to let players directly affect their interactions during these turf wars. 
Recent leaks point to the player possibly being able to join or fight up to six different factions within the world of Leonida. We've already seen some of these factions with a group of dirt bikers, as well as the High Rollers lifestyle and the Thrillbilly Mud Club in the recent reveal trailer. Although it's unknown for sure if these leaks are accurate, Rockstar could be potentially giving players more choice than ever over how their character fits into the wider scope of the criminal underworld of Vice City. Number 3. Leonida While many details still need to be confirmed, GTA 6 looks to be Rockstar's biggest game to date. Recent leaks have pointed to Leonida, Rockstar's version of Florida, being at least twice the size of GTA 5's Los Santos, with many reports indicating that it could include as many as four to five fully developed cities and surrounding boroughs. We've already seen the likes of the Vice City Strip, but keen-eyed Floridians will also recognize the Everglades as well as the Florida Keys and the famous Seven Mile Bridge. Given the scope of GTA 6, it's not unreasonable for players to expect to be able to explore the entirety of Leonida when GTA 6 finally releases. Number 2. Everything old is new. We've been talking about expanding down south, right? Vice City is 24 karat gold these days. The Colombians, the Mexicans, hell, even those Cuban refugees are cutting themselves a piece of some nice action. With Red Dead Redemption 2 seemingly being the last game co-founder and head writer Dan Hauser worked on before leaving Rockstar, there was some concern that the new GTA would lack the Rockstar feel the series has become known for. However, with Dan Hauser's brother Sam still in charge of the company, GTA 6 looks to not only revisit Vice City, but also bring back some of the anarchy of the early GTA trilogy. While more recent entries like GTA 4 and 5 took a more serious approach to their storytelling, GTA 6 looks to be finding a balance between the two. Much of the trailer focuses on the over-the-top antics of Vice City's residents, while also highlighting the emotional partnership between the game's two leads. Trust. Trust. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure to go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. 2026 While we're obviously hoping for the best and would love to see Rockstar hit their projected 2025 release window, the company has a track record of delays that's hard to ignore. Given the developers' focus on delivering the best possible experience, their last three major games, Grand Theft Auto 4, Grand Theft Auto 5, and Red Dead Redemption 2 have all suffered month to sometimes year-long delays. Given that this looks to be Rockstar's most ambitious game to date, and considering the scale of what the team is creating, it's entirely possible we could see the game slip into 2026, potentially making it one of the last true swang song titles for the 10th generation of consoles. Fingers crossed that we're wrong about this one. Lucia, do you know why you're here? Bad luck, I guess. What are you most looking forward to in GTA 6? Let us know down in the comments. Did you enjoy this video? Check out these other clips from WatchMojo and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.